We'll see a new intake of players mixing with a couple of old faces from last year and they're here at Welford Road today. Can you tell us a little bit about the reasons for that? Um, so part of it is um, around, uh, we have a media day normally every year um, to get their headshots done, get a bit of uh, information about the lads. Uh, we thought we'd um, bring them down to the stadium. Um, part of it is we, we want the lads to connect to, to the club, not just the history of the club, but the here and now. Um, and so um, we've had some good meetings with, uh, with Andrea and just been around the place. And so it's just a good, good chance for them to see um, part of the business that they, they wouldn't normally see at Oval Park. Um, and for the, um, for the staff here to, to get involved and get to know some of the, some of the young lads uh, in the academy. Andrea, a busy day for you. Or probably a less busy day actually in a weird way you get to good day a interesting day more enjoyable day you picked the minds of the academy kids today yep what did you have them doing upstairs well for us it was it was uh kind of key goals on decision making uh, leadership communication all those skills that in business and on the pitch are transferable um and it was actually really interesting for us because we split them between sales and marketing we gave them tasks to do, and then they were presenting on ideas that the club could adopt. Um, and I did actually say that we'd incentivise them if we adopted any, so that helped a little bit. Uh, and they were really, really good, very enthusiastic, threw themselves into it. Um, I think the competition helped a little bit. Um, but some good ideas came from it, uh, both on season ticket marketing and on uh, some of the coaching clinic sales. You've been here a while, a board member now, director. How important is this to be able to mix the next generation of Tigers with oh, this vital. side of the business? For me, I think it's vital because, unfortunately, it's the fact that not all of these guys will make it. And if we can help them with um, their studies, um, a lot of them are doing some business studies, which, which is interesting to see. But also, um, a few of them have spoke to me about work experience gaining key skills for them to go out into the wide world and decide what they want to do. If we can help that in any way, shape or form, and also, of course, keep some of that talent for ourselves. If it doesn't work out with them on the pitch, hopefully it'll work out with them off the pitch and, and we can utilise all their training and skills um, for the club in, in any way, shape or form. For more videos and interviews, keep watching LTTV.